This is Reptile Addiction's store tour of the snake room. So, very small room. I'm closed in with the window. Kind of uh, keep the heat regulated a little bit better in here. Out there we have all the big snakes and the bow files. But in here, let's see, we'll start with, we have a pure Venezuelan red tail. Cinnamon, ball python, normal ball python, black pastel ball python, pinstripe ball python. He's gorgeous. Hi, pretty boy. Yes, you are. Come up here where everybody can see you. Yes, he's gorgeous. He is getting big, big, big. I'm a big guy. Oh, I guess it would help if I kept the video on him. He's getting really large, though. Pretty, pretty boy. I think it's like 550 grams right now. Pinstripe. Got a yellow belly hiding under the towels there. Blonde pewter. That one has a, well, what has been disputed by one person, but five other people told me that it is a paradox mark. I am certainly no ball python expert, so I will show you. Right there, it's got a big yellow patch right there on his white, otherwise he's gray and white. This isn't very good lighting or anything here, but he's got this yellow patch on him. I've been told it's a paradox mark, do not know. But I know he's a blonde pewter. Little Mojave. Uh, ghost ball. Orange ghost ball python. This guy's getting big too. Not pretty. Come here. So everybody can see you. Orange ghost. He's a very sweet snake. He's 500 and something grams. Sable ball python hiding under the towels, of course. We didn't sable. All the little alien heads. Neat snake. All the little alien faces are what's intriguing. It's a sable. It's an unrelated head ghost female. The goat that ghost. 100% head albino, red tail boa. It was a breeding of a call coral albino and salmon head albino from Tom Burke. So, nice little snake. Didn't come out as gorgeous as some of its siblings, but pretty clean snake. Oh, there you go. And down here we have a pied ball python. Certainly the crowd fave. Oh, hi. He's getting big, too. He's five-something. Interesting markers. He's got that with the two dashes. That circle, and he has... Come here. Oh. Let me sit over here so everybody can see you. And at the end of his tail, he's got the marking with the two dashes, too. And then I like to call him Tippy, because he has this white tail tip end. He acting silly. Come out. So, he's pretty. Pretty boy getting big. I'm a big guy. All of these guys are on Frozen Thawed every week. Keep full records. Hatch date, breeder, bowel movements, urinates, shedding, feeding, food prey item, day fed, etc. It's a coral sunglow male. A coral sunglow lipstick line female she is very pretty 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 girl interesting look at the viewfinder and look at her she's much orange and pinky in person than she is on that on my video screen anyways there uh, hypo head coral sun glow red tail boa got a nice big guy Call strain albino. He's a sweetheart. There's a coral albino back there. Super hypo. 
red tail boa. I like to call this one flower. Flower won't try to kill us. Of course, flower is a very grumpy snake. But I call this one flower because of that right there on the tail. Oh, come here. See the flowers? And then it has like flower patterning down it. But that one to me looks like a flower. I'm sure he, because it is a male, does not appreciate me calling it a flower. Probably why he tries to always bite me. He doesn't much care for me. And then we have a with my thing here. Pet albino, red tail boa. Next one, little wee baby back there. Uh, hypo, double hat for coral sunglo, female. She could go with the pretty male if somebody didn't have all the millions of dollars in the world to spend on the pretty pairing. She's pretty, bigger girl. Look at my fingers. Yes, that's pretty tight you're holding on. <laughs> you're ready to go somewhere now, huh? Alright, we got a uh, poor man's blue eyed leucistic. Little leucistic rat snake in there. We won't mess with. He's a little crabby butt, too. Little spotted python down there. Over here, tiger retic. Up here, Colombian rainbow boa, some little Nelson's albino milk snakes, Pluvlin apricot milk snake, the little crabbiest one ever, I just changed his paper towel and he ruined it, little yellow rat snake, and here we have some little rosy boas. Little Bay of LA rosies. Uh, albino Honduran milk snake hiding under the paper towel. Etheristic Honduran milk snake. Head tangerine, head hypo. Interesting snake. Pretty rose color snake. I thought that one was kind of neat. So I bought it. Blood python. Pretty big guy. He's 800 and some odd grams. Uh, red blood python female. A albino Burmese python. His name is Nun. And his name is Nun because of... Move your neck, Nun. Move your neck, sweetheart. Come on, Krabby. Right there. See? Nun. That's his name. Because it says it so. It says so on him. High contrast. He's actually a pretty orange in person. Crabbiest snake in the entire world. Albino Burmese. The lights are off. I had to do this after everybody left because I couldn't get done with anybody here. Brazilian rainbow bow cruises around in there. Little pretty green tree python. Pretty little baby. A male corn snake. We get lots and lots of little corn snakes. They sell out pretty quick. All their little pretty color morphed ones. Little Amel. Little banana. King snake, some little ghost motley corn snakes, doom rolls boa, doom rolls boa, and that is our snake room. <laughs>